All right, we're getting ready to basically make sure that these stop cracking. See like how this is already drying out? And I'm glad I can't find any quickly on this one. So we're just gonna preserve everything. And how you do that, you'll use, use some wood glue, some water, just break it down, and then just brush it all on is what we're gonna do. And you'll see a big like before and after and if you don't do this, after a while, it might take a year or two, and they'll just start to crumble apart. So, here we go. Cut the bottle, very small amount of water. What this is basically doing is you're just really, you're diluting the glue to where when the bone sucks up all the water, it's just allowing the glue to get inside there. And we're going to like, we're going to coat this about four times. I'm going to stir this all up and then we're going to get thicker on the mixture and you're going to want to do like a 50-50 mix. And when you lay this glue down, it's gonna look like you put way too much on it and you ruined it, but if you just leave it alone, don't mess with it, it'll be fine. And you'll see that later on. Love you too, baby. Now watch me if I go up the steps and watch you, okay? Alright. So, here it all is when it's mixed up. You can see it's still very runny. It's going to be just like water. And here these all are, <clears throat> all are rinsed up. We're just going to brush on there. All right, here's the first coat. And all this would, all this is gonna dull up. It's gonna soak everything up. And um, main thing is just make sure there's no real big buildup. You know, just kind of brush it a little bit more and let all that get soaked up. It's gonna turn out really nice. So we're gonna keep on doing this. Like I said, it's gonna be about four of them and then we're going to make it a lot thicker, not a lot thicker, but we're going to definitely make the solution, you know, the glue to water. And then that's going to be a wrap.
All right, these have about 10 more minutes to go. I can throw on another little coat of the thin mixture. And one thing I want to mention is, is I'm constantly moving these and, you know, wiping away any kind of buildup. So you want to do that so the newspaper doesn't stick to the bottom and there's no buildup. So we're going to go ahead and get going with that. Just want to include that real quick. I know what you're thinking, that's a lot. And it looks like it, that's that thicker coat that I was talking about and before like I do another layer, I'll show after this soaks in. But like I said, we're gonna keep it moving, we're gonna take away any of the buildup spots and should be good to go. After about 15 minutes, this is what they look like. So like I said, it'll look like you have way too much on it just leave it alone take away any of you know the like I still got to brush this a little bit more just kind of even it out so it doesn't you know build too much up but I'm gonna do one more coat and I'll show you after that coat what it all looks like that'd be pretty much it all right turn it out really nice Here's everything finished up, and I love the way it turned out, it looks great. So yeah, some water, wood glue, and a bunch of coats, and we don't have to worry about them splitting, you know, drying out, and it'll be nice to display for years to come. All right, thanks everybody for watching, and I ain't saying that this is the official best way of doing this. This is just the way that works for me. All right, good luck everyone out there.